Hey Battle Pirates, it's Price is Wrong uh, from Battle Vortex. I'm actually getting ready to uh, knock out the time limited campaign, uh, Drac Hunt, uh, Drac Attack is what it's called. And uh, I've actually heard some crazy stuff. You'll see what I'm talking about in just a minute, maybe. Anyway, intro. All right, <clears throat> I do want to go out and get some dredges to uh, dredges actually come out in about an hour. Um, I don't know how many good dredges, fresh dredges are out right now, but <clears throat> anyway, not a big deal. I guess the first thing that I want to do, because uh, this new uh, this new Drac uh, attack campaign is for shipbuild tokens. So the first one gives you six hours, the second one gives you six one-hour tokens and a 12-hour. Okay, so that's 24 hours right there. And um, I'm sorry. Well, that's yeah, six hours. Then it's a six and a 12. So now we're up to 24. And then the 24-hour token. So it's 48 hours worth. So the first thing you want to do really, um, because you're not going to have room, this is going to max your storage out, is you want to check your existing tokens, ship build tokens. Oh, did I use them all already? I thought I still had another hour somewhere. Oh well, I must have used it. Yeah, I must have used it. I, uh, I didn't recall using it, but I must have. So anyway, that just means that I'm freed up where I can go ahead and uh, knock it out. Go ahead and launch. Oh, my. I don't know why I just did that. Want everybody to know I got a proto. It's all good. All right, let's start the campaign. All right. Now, as I've been understanding, this thing is bugged. Okay, but you know it's been out for nine hours now. It's uh, noon my time, and it's been out for nine hours. It would have started at 3 a.m. my time. So I don't know if it's fixed yet or not. I kind of hope it is. I'd really like to do it for reals, um, but um, I'm gonna go take it, check check it out and see what happens. All right. All right. Well, it says Drac attack, right? But the first thing I notice is that we are got reavers in here, and this does look like the. Um, it looks like the. Uh, what is the uranium campaign called? I can't even remember it. You remember the name of the uranium campaign right now, babe? Well, everything was moving, but it did kick me out. It did kick me out, and it gave me build tokens. No, I wasn't going rogue. Um, going rogue was for the uh, let it burn. That was it. I thought it was looked like the let it burn campaign, but then all of the scouts started moving. All right. I don't know what they're going to do with this. Yeah, thank you, Andy. All right, so this one looks like the first one, but it's got a Hulk in here. Um, let's just zoom out and let's go. All right, so they don't all move on this one. Man kicked. And I'm, I'm presuming this is going to continue. My wife's finding out the same thing. I see her over there. The rest of the campaigns work fine. The rest of the campaigns work fine. I was hoping they're going to give me a few bits. I think they do. The other campaigns work fine. It's just that one. I didn't even get to look at that whole one. I didn't even get to look at that whole one. All right, so I'm done with the two waves. Let's 
weird, man. I think I got like a piece of cat hair or something in my mouth. It was weird. Maybe it was dog hair. I was loving on my dog. Alright. Here's the big one. Well, that's a long wait for judges, man. Judges aren't for another hour. Let me see here. All right, so this one here is unlike the first wave. It's got um, a lot more scouts in it and two hulks. So I got three, seven scouts and two hulks. Two scouts move and a hulk moves. Yeah, man, it is disappointing that it's glitched. I agree completely. I agree completely. But, you know, I'm not going to lie. Um, I mean, it's not like I'm trying to get on here and hang out all day. I'm kind of done with that, you know. All right, let me zoom out and look at this one. Okay, this one's got three hulks in it, and five five scouts and I'm just going to just drive straight in maybe I get to kill something all right so I'm going to try, try to drive straight in see if I can kill something all right I, I, I didn't see I probably should have checked to see what was moving but I didn't all right this last one I'm not going to tell, give my boats any direction, so I want him to just go in and try to kill something. But I'm going to zoom out, and I'm going to click start and look for moving boats. Hey, Flying Frog. Alright, so here I, I see there's a Berserker, two Berserkers. One, two, three, four scouts, five scouts, one, two, three, three hulks. All right, so we got two scouts, three scouts moving, and a hulk moving. But then it's all over. But it did look like Let It Burn. You know, a lot of it did look like Let It Burn. Except for that first one where I had three scouts that were moving. But just like that, it's done. Kicks at its finest. I don't know what to say. You know, um, you know, I, I don't know what to say about Kicksai at this at this point. You know, I, that that everybody doesn't already know. You know, except for the folks at Kicksai, they don't they don't seem to recognize how much crap that they put out that doesn't work right. You know what I mean? When it's put out, you know, it's like they don't test anything. Uh, they do have quality control, but I think it's them like checking their own work. It's just like, you know, uh, I remember, you know, back in high school or whatnot, when the teacher would have you check your work, you'd just give yourself 100, you know? So I aced it. You know what I'm saying? I think that's what's going on. People there are checking their own work, and they call that quality check. I, I, I just don't know what's going on over there. And uh, obviously it's a management problem. You know, it, it's a management problem. So let's let me take a look and see what the dredges look like. Uh, dredges. Alright, so this will take me to 73. Let me see if there was uh, anything below those. Oh, dredges. Oh, there's a 50. Yeah, I'm going to wait. People sniping at towers. Look at that. That's terrible, man. People sniping at towers. I really hope he gets them. You know what I mean? No offense against folks that enjoy sniping. I mean, it's cool and all. I just, uh, I don't particularly care for it. You know, anything that keeps pe other people from being able to play and enjoy the game, I, I, I disagree with. 
short of actually playing the game, but I don't know. I don't know if I'd actually really call this that. I mean, it's like there's no challenge here. You know what I mean? I mean, if you lose any boats when you're sniping with uh, the subs, Nighthawks, if you lose any boats when you're sniping with Nighthawks, then uh, it's because you screwed up. Excuse me. Sorry. Still sort of kind of waking up. Yeah, so that's a shame, really, that that's happening. But it, it is happening. BPL. All right. All right, well, there it is. Now, I do currently have a ship um, building, and uh, it's currently got four days and 18 hours. Um, I can't speed it up to a convenient time right now. Okay, uh, speeding up to a convenient time for me right now is just simply not going to happen. Um, just trying to think here. Let me... Uh, I don't know what else to do, guys, right now. I guess I could take my boats out and kind of rank them a little bit. Um, yeah, 17 minutes. Alright, so maybe I'll do that. I don't remember if that's got... Okay. So let me not use this slot right here. Instead, I'll use, like, another empty slot. i got to find an empty slot. I just go out and kill some cargo for an hour. Hopefully you guys are okay with that. Oops. Obviously I can't put that there. I could put it here though. getting harder and harder to manage boats, man. It really is. Hey, Scorpio. Oh, maybe I should have put a salty dogs on that, actually. Let me do that real quick. Heck, might as well. Hey, take care, Andy. You have a good, good weekend. A flying frog, I think you could probably put a gunboat in there and drive away, and it'll be fine. I think if you put a gunboat in there and drive away, it'll be fine. I mean, that's what it looked like to me. Anything would work. I'm going to step away just for a second. I'm going to just grab a drink. Uh, maybe I should get you guys some music, though. Give me a second here. I'll get you guys some music. Hey, I like licking things. I'm just stepping away just for a second. I'll be right back. I'm like I said, I'm just gonna go grab a uh, drink real fast, probably a glass of milk. I'll be right back. I'm back. My, my wife's going to take care of me. She's going to get my glass of milk and all that stuff. She's awesome. She's also going to get me, nick me a biscuit. 
sausage, egg, and cheese brisket. Isn't she awesome? And yes, I did get my tokens. I did, I did. Oh, I forgot to turn this camera back on. Hold on a second. Alright. Anyway, uh, I'm going to go ahead and put a crew on here and I just go out and do a little bit of ranking. What, do I have a crew anywhere else? I do. Let me just put something in here real quick. I guess it don't matter what it is. I'm just curious. Alright, this is what I'm going to do then. I'm going to go ahead and move this up to that slot there. And, uh, do it there. Because, uh, I'll go ahead and pay for the extension one time. That way I'm not pulling out new crew. I keep tying up slots with, uh, I keep tying up slots with, um, crews. I need to stop doing that. Take them out here and um, just go to work. Let's do this. I know it's green, so y'all might not be able to see it, but it does say Flonase. It's Flonase on there. It's terrible, you know, because I have to take this stuff every morning, and then I take uh, Zyrtec. Isn't that terrible? If I don't, I'm miserable. It really sucks. Thank you, babe. Appreciate it. My life's great. I actually do do a sinus rinse. I, uh, I, I don't use a neti pot, but I... Uh, I, 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 it's, it's the same thing though. It's saline rinse, and um, so it's the same thing. But it's a saline rinse. I, I do that every now and then. Really, just when I'm congested or whenever I feel like I need it, I'll do it.
you guys take vitamins? Is that Comac? Holy crap. Comac, man. Long time. Man. Really long time. What aligns you with these days? You still see TMX? Thank you, uh, Wiz. I got stuff stuck in my teeth. Okay, I'm back. Are you looking for a group, man? I've got some of my ships there a little bit. I just zoom out here a little bit. Oh, you were tired. Scrapped all your ships. Holy crap, dude. You know, I'm I'm ready to retire myself, but I'm not going to do anything drastic like that. I mean, I really don't see them fixing the game and putting it back to, you know, because according to them, if they do what we ask them to do, then uh, they're basically going to be putting themselves out of business. And they still we still won't be able to enjoy the game because it would be no game. So I'm like, you know, I'm like, it's a shame that they're in that position, but it really is a shame. Just turn around and spawn these 71s right next to me. 
It's so sweet. I got somebody else is out here ranking. Hey Wiz, I, I I made a new uh, a new scene on my uh, on my game here. I call it uh, I call it uh, the boom screen. I thought it was cool. All I gotta do is click a button. But the thing is, okay, um, do you use OBS? I think you do uh, use OBS. What if when you go back to your game, you know how sometimes you'll click the up arrow, and um, you click the up arrow. If you actually have the OBS software still, uh, you know, like selected, and you hit up arrow, it jumps to the previous scene, which is my intro. So basically, it'll take people back to my intro, and uh, so I, I kind of did that a little bit couple of times. But now that I know what's going on, I'm cool. Like, I just gotta make sure I get, actually click on my game screen again, so that I know that uh, when I hit the up arrow that I'm not jumping, pushing everybody back up to the intro. Yeah, that Drac attack, we're talking about it in the comms right now, that Drac attack is something else, right? I mean, because where's the Drax? If they're, first, you're fighting Reavers. I mean, I know the whole thing's just screwed up and bugged anyway, but I'm just saying. You're going out and you're fighting Reavers. You're not fighting Drax. And you don't really even fight, because they time it out. I like milk. Looks good. When I was young, I could drink like a quart of this every day, man. Just drink a quart. I, I stopped doing that, man, because I started getting like calcium deposits, man. You know when you like flick your wrist or whatever and you, uh, you can hear the, the pop, you know, that little crackle. I started getting like calcium deposits. So I quit drinking so much milk. But I really like it. I really like milk. I guess maybe I can uh, explain what I'm doing with my ships here so that it makes it so I can auto the cargo like this. Alright. Uh, the first thing I'm going to explain, obviously, is the boats that I'm trying to uh, rank up, which is my Crusaders. Really not much to explain there because they're largely irrelevant. The main thing that they need to be able to do is kill cargo. Okay, uh, just kill salvage. The real hero here is the Spectre Sub. Okay, the Spectre Sub is a decoy. It doesn't have uh, any armor on it, okay? Uh, there's nothing on there for cloaking. Uh, that means no Cat 3. And set up put Battery 3 so it stays under longer. And uh, 
I put a Reaper Scout engine on it to make it fast, and uh, it really just needs to be faster than the Crusaders. And it's got a combat speed of 25. Uh, my Crusaders got a combat speed of 23. And so that's like the main thing uh, as far as the speed goes. But, it, well, it's visible and it's fast. Okay. I only put one torpedo on it. Um, is because I really, you know, it's got to have some kind of offensive weapon on it to uh, drive it. Okay. But, um, so it's got one torpedo on it. Uh, let me see. That's my number four. See, I just got one assault torpedo B down there. So, uh, so I got Reaver Scout engine for, and that's double speed. And you see, it also uh, cuts the the weapon range in half, the torpedo range in half. That just means the Spectre's got to get a lot closer, and uh, which is also good for me, you know. So that makes it the perfect decoy. And um, the Triton in the back is really just an extra. Uh, it, it's mainly, obviously, it's a countermeasure hull. And that's pretty much what I'm using it for. It's all anti-morts, and it does have UABs on it. It does have UABs on it, because it's got to have an offensive weapon on it to drive it as well. And uh, But I think I actually have like four UABs on it. As a matter of fact, I have it selected down here. There's four UABs. I got four Hailstorm A's and two Hailstorm B's. It's mainly an anti-mortar ship is what I use this one for. Uh, I do have other ones that are mixed, and I even have one that's primarily anti-missile. Um, but all of my Tritons are countermeasure Tritons. If you do have the Harlock's Triton from the uh, from the campaigns, uh, it's better than this, and I would definitely recommend going that route if you've never built any Tritons. Yeah, OBS is free software. Yeah, OBS is free. Uh, Twitch is free. I don't pay anything for Twitch. Now, um, there are, OBS doesn't have any limitations for it being free, but uh, Twitch does. Uh, Twitch, you can't archive your videos indefinitely um, unless you pay. Uh, if you don't pay, you can only keep them for two weeks. That's why I export my videos, Twitch videos, to YouTube. Because obviously YouTube is free. I can put my videos on there all day long. And, um, um, you could even use XSplit for free if you wanted. Um, XSplit Broadcaster can be used for free. It's also Twitch streaming software, and it's got some really cool stuff. Uh, and it, I actually use that pretty much on every Battle Pirate Vortex. Every Battle Vortex shows what I use as XSplit. Um, I only use OBS when I'm doing my Twitch streaming. Yeah, I never went the Harlock Triton uh, route simply because I already had regular Tritons built. You know, even though the Harlock Triton is much better, it's like, you know, I just redoing things in this game is... Oh, hold on a second, I just realized my chat here is screwed up. Let's see here. There we go, I think that's it. Um, XSplit is, is free. And I use it on every uh, Battle Vortex show, you know, because I, I use my green screen on there, too, on the Battle Vortex show. And I put my slides up behind me and all that cool stuff. But I do that with XSplit. And that's because XSplit will function as a uh, webcam. So what I can do is I use XSplit as a webcam in my uh, Google Hangouts when I'm doing the Battle Vortex stuff. All right, I gotta fix this music real quick. Now I do have countermeasures on my Crusaders also that will help with the Morts, um, but they'd had the Morts stuff to get past the Triton, which is really tough to do. The worst thing that I have to deal with on here is the um, rockets. You see the rocket splash gets me a little bit. A 
always, yeah, you, yeah, you can always, yeah, you, you can, uh, you shouldn't, uh, decide not to stream if somebody else is streaming, um, you know, because there's, there's multi-twitch.tv, yeah, you know, because I know Wiz was streaming before I came on, but I was going to, I just wanted to stream anyway, just to get my stuff knocked out, but yeah, you, um, yeah, I, I mean, I, I I don't want anybody to not stream because I'm streaming. And we do got the multi-twitch.tv link, so if you uh, if you're streaming, we can do multi-twitch.tv and then slash wizard1032 slash price is wrong, you know, slash Vincent Gamer1337, you know, and I'm just saying that you can have everybody going at once. Yeah, I don't know about thousands. I, I sometimes I'll break a thousand views on a video. Uh, a lot of times I don't even break a hundred views on a video. You know what I mean? Uh, on even on YouTube. Um, but I do put out a lot of videos, so I do have some people that will try to watch everything I put out. I don't understand it, but you know, there's. Uh, well, I guess I sort of kind of do a little bit because uh, you know we don't all know everything. And, uh, and a lot of times it's just assumed that people know things that they don't know. And so they're just left in the dark. They, nobody ever tries to teach them. And uh, that, I've been a victim of that all my life, you know what I mean? Where people are like, hey, I'm a smart guy, you know. Because I'm a smart guy, they, uh, they just assume I know everything. And, uh, and uh and then it's just there's certain things that it's just like I said assumed that I know so nobody ever tells me so uh, that's where the videos come in the videos come in handy that way Crazy, man. Crazy. Alright. Doing good on time, man. It's 26 minutes. Doing great on time. Excuse me again. Now time for mint. Um, this is uh, I use royalty free uh, rock music, and uh, it's 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 royalty free rock music in the background. Uh, Techno Axe is the guy. T E K N O A X E. Techno Axe, and he. Uh, it's royalty free, which just means simply that he doesn't charge for its use, and you can have it in the background, and it's not a problem. You know what I mean? That's the whole point of it. And uh, usually, if you play like other music, which I've done, I've had I've had done streams like what Wiz does. Wiz doesn't archive anything or push anything to YouTube. But you know, if he tried, they would freak out on him. Okay, they would block his videos in like every country. Uh, I, I, the one I did when I tried to include in the music, even though I thought I could get away with just not monetizing, and um, but they ended up blocking it like every country, you know, including this one. So I just uh, I went ahead and I just I, I killed that one and I just uploaded it again with no sound. People were like, "Hey, no sound, no sound," but you know that's how it works.
Yeah, I thought I did all of that. I thought I tried everything that I could, and I, uh... Maybe I just... Maybe I missed a step. Maybe I should look into that sometime. Yeah, see this way here, I can have music, I can have me talking, everybody can hear everything. Just royalty free. So if you go on YouTube, do a YouTube search, you're royalty free, or maybe you can get a CD or something like, like that that's all royalty free music, I don't know, but... You definitely want to get a large rotation of music though, because... Uh, People that watch your stream regularly, they, they start to learn the songs, and they get tired of hearing them. Alright, I'm going to step away for a second again, as soon as this combat starts, and just to get me something else, uh, maybe water or tea or something, so, come on, let's start. Be right back, guys. Alright, I'm back. Sorry about that, folks. Well, I got my pirate cup. <clears throat> it's not my magic cup, but it's my pirate cup. No, I'm MBK. Yeah, I'm still MBK. Wiz up here is MBK. Um, Toxic gets on here from time to time. He's MBK. Yeah, MBK's done pretty good. I mean, we've lost a few. We've gained a few. Um, I don't know everybody in MBK anymore. Um, I don't know what to do about that. I mean, you know, I, I did try following people and following the group around. But it's like all it does is get my fleet sniped, man, and I don't want to play. Freaking butthurt pirates, man, start sniping fleets, you know. You know how it is. You've been there, bud. I know you have. Yeah, I've been MBK a long time, man. I'm not going to wear any other tags. MBK's it. Uh, unless MBK went away. It's the only way I'd wear another tag.
that campaign man is like big news today. <laughs> I'm telling you what, it is it's huge news. And some of them rockets fly far. You jump out early. You jump out early, um, then uh, you know you, you can uh, avoid the whole loading screen thing if you want. But I forget it most of the time. I don't know. I just kind kind of got a little lazy and complacent. I think. Yeah, man, I do. I like that band. 500 Death Punch is pretty awesome. I like them. Hey, Brian Griffin. Another stash of 71s now, darn it. Darn it. Or start hitting 51s. How's your res looking, baby? You need res? Uh, there's tons of 71s at her open if you want to pick up. Hey, God Chef. The Babel, what's up? Well, uh, the Babel, if, if, did you ever change your uh, your other uh, your, your password for your other account? I know a few months back they had that security breach. I'm gonna go up here next. Yeah, all the way around the whole ring, babe. There's so many ones open. Yeah, that's weird, man. I don't know. I won't tell ya. Yeah, I mean, you know, I hate to say, whatever, I, I know that uh, was not as intended, but you know what? I don't know, man. I think I think the issue over at Kick Size, people over there, they're too smart for their own good. And it, it's like, you know, they, it, it's hurting them, you know what I mean? They don't check themselves.
Can't wait to see what kind of rank I get off of this. Um, yeah, she doesn't need res, but she did build a boat, so she's not full. So she doesn't need res whiz, but she is, um, she's not full. Because she said she started her new boat this morning. Yeah, if you need res, uh, she's fine with letting you have it. Hey, R.G. Smith. Yes, yes, R.G. Smith, yep. Uh -huh. Oh, you just offloaded yours, okay. <laughs> yeah, that's probably what happened to R.G. Smith. They hooked everybody up because I coined some repairs yesterday. <laughs> that's exactly what happened. I'm in Alpha, the Bevel. Yeah, and hey, Maid. <laughs> yeah, the kicks I screw up. Yeah. Man, I've had in game messages. I've had Facebook messages, man. Like, oh, crap. Didn't mean to do that. Uh, I, I mean, it's just been crazy, man. Um, yeah, I, I, you know, and I figure, you know, well, it's nine hours later because I did mine at noon and it started at 3 a.m., that particular campaign, and they hadn't fixed it. After nine hours, it's still not fixed, so. Yeah, and you know, uh, Vengeance, what you said earlier about people potentially sniping my fleet, is there are douchebags in the game that will do that. And um, they know they're douchebags. You know what I'm saying? And uh, it's all good, man. It's all good. You know, if, if, if it happens, it happens. I hope it doesn't. It just means my I'll be done playing Battle Parts for a little while. That's all it means to me. I don't know, Comex. I, I don't know if I'm moving or not. I um, I'm not not. I don't have any plans right now. I don't have any plans for relocating at the moment. Mate, if somebody at Kicks I got fired for this, I'd be shocked because they all do it. <laughs> they all do it. They are all screw ups. Well, not all of them, but they're not all screw-ups. I should not say they're all screw-ups. They do have some really talented, competent people there. 
but just sadly, you know, they're not, I don't know, they're usually like the bosses and not like the front people, you know what I mean? Yeah, I'm still an alpha. You know, uh, RG Smith about the weekend crew a bit. That's quite possible. I, I, I don't, I don't think I doubt that. Y'all are hilarious about the last week model and stuff. Yeah, I did the Drac Attack uh, bucked up. I sure did. Dredge will be coming out here in a few minutes. Let's see what's my clock looking like on here. Seven minutes. I'm enjoying this. Maybe I just keep doing this. Yeah, it took me forever, man. I didn't think I was going to get through that one. <laughs> oh, gee, Smith. This is awesome, man. This is like the best ranking session I've had so far with the salvages. I'm sure this is not going to be anywhere near what I got uh, during the herbs yesterday, but this is a, probably going to be pretty awesome, though. I'm going to guess 8,000. What do you think? 8,000? 8, 8,000 sound good? I'm going for 8,000. I think we should take guesses. Everybody guess. I'm thinking 8,000 VXP for my Crusader fleet. You think? 3,200? You guys know I got a crew on here. I got a Salty Dog Throat crew on. 6590, 7500. Alright. I got uh, less than five minutes left on this crew. Eight thousand is pretty ambitious, I'll agree. But I'm I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. Eight thousand. Work, work, work. Work, work. Now, Comex is six thousand. ADH.
going to go out this last five minutes, man, with a bang. With a boom! Eight thousand and one. <laughs> It'd be like the price is right up on here. Two minutes fifty seconds for remaining. Need a green turtleneck. <laughs> he said I got him good. Uh, you know, I had a feeling all those little uh, asterisks on the screen might have been you uh, cursing. <laughs> I think I got my word filter on. Sorry about that, Comex. I, I enjoy doing that, though. I, I really do. I enjoyed it. Keeps the heart pumping, you know what I'm saying? Now, I'll, I'll quit when my timer's gone. Uh, so I, I'll keep checking my timer. Thirty-eight seconds, so this will probably be my last one right here, guys. Thirty-three seconds remaining. This will be my last one. You never knew she got banned? She got banned a long time ago now. It's been a while. Yeah. Alright. Confirmed. Crew is gone. Alright. Got an in-game message here. Yeah, I've been getting messages like that too, so about the uh, campaign being bugged. I hate passing up on all these other 71s. I really would have liked to finish doing them all. But, in, uh, in, in, in good fairness, uh, we need to see where I'm at. Archie Smith. <laughs> oh, you guys.
I'm ready for it now. Pow, 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 pow. Yeah, I, I hate people that play that way. Well, should, it's, hate, hate's a strong word. I just, I, I hate that people play that way. You know, with the ambushing the fleets, man, it's... I was, uh, the last two sectors I was in with uh, MBK, I mean, there's MBK here, but I'm just talking about MBK in mass. Um, uh, we had people sniping fleets, and I barely played. I barely played for like two weeks. All right, guys. Let's see where I'm at. 8,000, 8,000. Y'all ready? Y'all ready? I'm blocking it so y'all can't see it. I got 3,000. That's disappointing. Ah, uh, 3,000. Oh well. It was still fun for a minute. It was fun for a minute. Yeah, even with a crew. I don't know, I thought I was going to be better than that. Yeah, it's true. That's true, it's not like there were herbs. I got like 12,000 on herbs yesterday in one run, man. That was awesome. It was great. Uh, yes, I got a proto. It's pretty useless, but I got one. What? Alright, my boats are outside. Let me look out there. Sorry, right, babe. No snipers out here, Wiz, just so you know. I see you out here hitting cargo. I'm just letting you know, heads up, they're sniping. And I guess you got an invisible sub, so you shouldn't have to worry too much, but. Turn one boat around and get back towards them, and then let the rest of them go forward. them up, put one on each corner, and then uh, and take another one and drive back towards them. Well, yeah, I'd right, wait a minute, but you get what I'm saying. Yeah, drive into them with uh, one of your subs there. Or, Folks, that's what I do. I'll let you handle it. I mean, I don't know. You're not going to really survive anyway.
I hate to say it, they're fleet sniping, I'm not going to go do dredges. I wish I could snag him with my subs. You know what I mean? Hey, Captain Bird's Eye. Take care, Green Skull Republic. Uh, BPL is over here. Oh, yeah, that, that was, uh, yeah, just all token raid would be great. Great idea. As a matter of fact, I want to make sure that I mention that on the roundtable show today. Let me write that down, too. We got the round table show in about five hours. And, um, but yeah, I'm glad you, you said something, got on here and said something to me again, because that's a great idea. Apparently he's in Sector 59. Yeah, and bubbled, of course. BPL, I've heard of those guys. BPL. <coughs> Locker, is the name of the Alliance? This is Sector 59, and it's uh, Chords are 35025 by 381, but he's in a bubble. Hey, Dreadnought Lex. Yeah, that would be great too. Uh, great wish list idea to babble. We were actually talking about <clears throat> maybe doing another wish list show on like one of our slow Thursdays. If we can get a slow Thursday and doing like a wish list show and see if we can get uh, Doom Roost drawn with us. Uh, for, for I don't know that it would do a whole lot of good, to be honest with you. You know, because um, regardless of how he replies, to be honest with you, I just don't have a whole lot of faith. Uh, <clears throat> Even though he may personally listen, he doesn't. Uh, the people above him that he relays the information back to, I don't know if they listen to him. But um, so that's kind of where I'm at on that, you know. So he might like it. He might really enjoy coming on to a wish list show.
Oh, now your base is getting hit. That's one I can grab, though. It's the same alliance. Now, they might get her outpost. You see, she doesn't keep a card either. But because most of her turrets are in the back back here, she does crazy damage to anybody who hits her. Yeah, they're not really, they're, as far as, I think they may have secret projects in the works, but they still rely very heavily on income from Battle Pirates. Um, they rely very heavily on income from Battle Pirates. That's why everything is so ridiculously expensive. You know, I think they recognize that there's a cost issue and a value issue over here in Battle Pirates, but uh, it's a means to an end for them. You know, Battle Pirates is not their love. It's their, it's their, their well-being. I don't think anybody over there really takes a whole, you know, a, a ton of pride in battle parts. Build a Wendigo? Yeah, you did. Your Wendigo is awful far back, though. Let me see, that's one, two, three. It's well over about three and a half land tiles out. Oh, there it goes. It's shooting. Nice. Day. I mean, I see he got you, but he's got he's got nothing left on there to shoot with. No, oh, he does got an arbalist. It looks like a couple arbalists actually on that Grimshine. I think I see a couple of cannons on there. Yeah. Yeah, she kicks a lot of butt with that base. I mean, you know, she doesn't put a guard in. She won't put a guard in. She's like me with that. Now, you get some people uh, that feel like they, they'll hit her just because she doesn't have a guard, but she makes them pay. Yeah, I, you, I told you you were getting hit already. She didn't even know she was getting hit. She wasn't watching at all. Well, now your doc's dead. But you wrecked him, wrecked him pretty good. You got, only thing that's got left is a Grimshine out there. She wasn't even watching. She had uh, headphones in her ear, so she didn't even hear me talking about her. She's sitting right there. She didn't hear me at all. Yeah, she just kind of looked up and noticed that I was talking about her base, and she didn't understand why I was talking about her base. That's hilarious. What's your clock look like? Oh. Yeah, he's probably going to jump out first and looking for ninjas, probably expecting me out there.
Uh, her her face is not designed to, for a guard. You notice how narrow her channel is. You know, between the, the back channel. That's very narrow. She's not designed for a guard. She's designed. She, her base is intentionally designed that way. You know. Crap! I missed him. I just got the text that your base was hit, I think. Yep. Yeah, just got the notice. Alright. Oh well, I didn't get him, babe. Yeah, he was almost dead. Yeah, you kicked his butt, I mean... Yeah, everybody's drag attack is glitched, Magic Boofy. I don't get notifications when my base is hit. I, I don't hear about it. When when her base gets hit, I hear about it. And also, my son has a base, and he doesn't even play anymore. More, but when somebody hits his base, I get a I get an email. So anyway, yeah, if they're out here sniping fleets, I'm not going to do any dredges, guys. I uh, I hate to say I'm I'm not going to do any dredges. I'm just going to live with what I have. Um. Currently, I'm at, uh, my uranium count's at 80,000, 82,000. I think that's pretty good. Uh, I'm pretty happy with that. Uh, my research, i still got another day and a half of research going. Um, I still have another day and a half of research going. Let me see. Um, I'm doing the Nighthawk sub right now. And uh, uh, my tokens that I had won from the uh, campaign, uh, I'll, I'll use those when I... Uh, when I can speed it up to a convenient time. When I, uh, if I can speed a ship build up to a time when it's convenient for me to start my next, then I will. But then again, I could probably just save it for putting the armor on my Crusaders. Because uh, my Crusaders need armor. The Crusaders need armor. But I guess I'm probably going to go get off of here, guys. I'm going to switch games. I'm in 72, Magic Booty. Yeah, you know, as far as the notifications go, I've actually gone as far as to... Uh, I've changed the email address. I've turned... Uh, let me turn that on. I'm just curious. Just to see what happens. I hate this freaking song. You gotta go. All right. All right. It says my settings have been saved, but we'll see. I have a feeling I'll be getting hit shortly. And uh, just because we're on somebody else's radar, I mean, nobody's got any reason to hit Victoria, but they do. On occasion, they'll still hit her. Um, she just had a fleet out picking up cargo, so they thought they would sniper fleet and then kill her base. Some people are just douches, but you know what? She don't care. She barely plays Battle Pirates anymore. She's playing another game right now. So, if they're looking for hurt feelings, they're not going to get it from her. Yeah, you should ask them. Yeah. Well, anyway, guys, uh, let me go ahead and do shout-outs real quick. I was going to Magic. Yeah, I don't blame you for using all your tokens. And I, I don't know that Kicks I would take them back, man. It'd be pretty messed up if they did. Yeah, and you know, I'm sure... My, my intention for the roundtable show tonight was to really talk about the... Uh, I really wanted to talk about Abyss and the future events. That's why I thought your all-token raid idea kind of fell in really good with that, uh, that particular line of discussion. But I have a feeling that this uh, Drac Attack campaign is going to be a huge discussion. Also, it's going to probably going to take over a big part of that. But yeah, Santana may very well be 50% of their income in. That guy spends like crazy. He he is definitely he's got to be the biggest spender in the game, and he's got to be. 
Well, you know, I thought that until that jackal guy got on here yesterday, made. <laughs> what site do uh, do you go to for roundtable? Oh, it's on YouTube. Um, fucked up. Are you not on our uh, on the BB page? Because uh, um, if you look in the events on the B BB page, that's HTTP BP dot Battle Vortex. All right, and uh, as a matter of fact, let me get the link for the YouTube. Hold on a second. Saturday, June 20th, that's today. What the heck? I, may, I might have screwed up, man. Put the wrong link on there. Man, just really lucky you guys in here hooking me up today. This right here is the, uh, I just put the YouTube link in here for the Hangout today, for today's Hangout. Um, Alright, I just approved two people. Now it works, that's weird. Awesome. Uh, I guess, again, I'm going to go ahead and do shoutouts real fast and I want to get off of here. Uh, Wizard1032 is on here. Backpack99. Bucked Up15. Captain Birdseye. DeBabble. DH397. Dreadmall X. Made You Ship Your Pants. Miguel42. Spartacus2804. Vengeance Gamer1337. Or Leeds. Uh, ZDog40. And uh, that's it. Um, so no more dredges. I was planning on doing dredges, but I won't do it with fleet snipers out and about. So. But you guys uh, take care. Have a good one. Boom! Just saying. <laughs> the price is wrong, bitch. <laughs>